The O'Gorman girls finished last year with a perfect 21-0 record before the state tournament was canceled. The Knights have picked up where they left off, opening the season with a pair of wins over rivals Roosevelt and Lincoln. Tonight, the Knights sought their third straight win against Yankton, and it was all gazelles early in the opening quarter. Paige Gullickson catches, splits the D, and banks through the bucket with the left hand as that gives Yankton an early 6-1 lead. Knights struggle to find an offensive rhythm early. Hannah Ronsett going to work in the post as she'll pivot around the D and lay in two of her 10 points. That's O'Gorman's first field goal of the game, six minutes in. Then late in the first quarter, O'Gorman working the ball from high to low as Bergen Riley's going to catch and put away two of her 10, giving the Knights the 9-8 lead after one. They then outscored Yankton 22-3 in the second quarter and never looked back for the 66-30 victory. Third-ranked Harrisburg hosted Roosevelt in its home opener this evening. Opening quarter, Harrisburg pushing the ball up court to Abigail Flanagan. She'll lay that in for twos. That gets the Tigers on the board. And next Harrisburg possession, they're going to get it to Breckley Honor. She'll drive to the hole, get the bucket to drop, plus the foul. Honor had a game-high 25 points in the game. And then Roosevelt's Kayla Martinez coming down the other way. She'll dribble down to the right wing and pops the three with no hesitation. Nothing but net. She had a team-high 13, but Harrisburg too much tonight as they pick up the 53-43 win over Roosevelt.